my name is Dr. Margaret Matonya. I come from Tanzania. I'm here in uh, India, Mumbai, with my son, Derek Johnny Mwagama, who is uh, had a challenges on uh, so cerebral pass and also epilepsy. So now the epilepsy almost uh, five years, and uh, her development was deteriorating. Uh, the speech went off. The ability of the brain was becoming weak. When Derek first came to us, his epilepsy syndrome was undiagnosed. Nobody knew what kind of epilepsy he had. We admitted him for a period of five days and diagnosed him with a relatively rare condition called lenos gastro syndrome. When he came to meet us at the epilepsy program, he was not in a very good condition with multiple seizures despite taking multiple medications. Uh, Dr. Siddharth Kharkar and I, we sat together, we went through his all records that were done earlier. We repeated his uh, EEG and uh, neuroimaging, his MRI, and then uh, came to a conclusion that he would benefit with vagal nerve stimulation. So had the vagus nerve stimulator implanted in the chest, just below the skin, and a small wire coming out from here loops around the nerve here, which prevents seizures, but especially the kind of seizures that result in sudden drop attacks which can damage the brain and other organs of the body. The surgery uh, took almost three hours and later when he came to the surgery room he was doing fine. From having multiple seizures a day, he is having no seizures for the past two or three months. This is a wonderful response to VNS which is not always achieved but we are extremely happy that it was possible in Derek's case. Derek has also shown a significant improvement in his cognitive and motor functioning. Before the surgery, Derek was not able to talk at all. Now he is able to express a few of his needs, including asking for water, telling his mother when he is hungry. We hope that Derek remains seizure free and continues to improve and regains some of his lost functionality which was taken away from him because of this disease. So we want to thank you very much for the team of international office, Nanabat International Office first. And the second one, we want to say thank you so much for doctors who worked as a comprehensive team to diagnose the challenges of Derek. So thank you so much for Dr. See that We lived here as we are at home. We didn't get any challenges being in Nanabat Hospital. Thank you.